all right what's good everybody it's your boy ace one as y'all see we're back here with the tournament of anime if you remember in the last video we sent superhero team fall to jojo bizarre adventure sadly man it was a crazy ass battle but today we're here with naruto and jjk before we get into that i want to say we are doing votes down below in the discord and um not votes but we do buffs and nerfs as y'all know every single video people get buffed and nerfed this is the multiverse buff chat if you guys want to see it join the discord down below and we literally do buffs nerfs all types of stuff every single day so you guys can to see many things many different things change many different things go around and it's going to be a few a crazy lit video but other than that also want to announce that we are starting multiverse rewards this means like lots of stuff as y'all see on the video y'all can pause it if y'all want to read it we are going to have mvps most improved players best assist all types of rewards and stuff like that and, and we're going to have an all-star weekend that's going to start before um the losers bracket we're going to take nine of our strongest people and then nine of strongest more people and we're going to put them against each other feel me voted by you guys you guys get to vote who y'all want to see best feminine moving character all that stuff so we're going to have a crazy ass little weekend man y'all let me know down below if you're excited for this my bad y'all know i got the alarm shit but let me know down below if you're excited for this shit man and shit but this shit is finna go crazy so y'all let me know down below man and hope y'all enjoy and shit let's get into the tournament of anime first match of naruto versus jjk and like i said man we were talking about the all-star weekend all types of stuff coming in it i'm not gonna lie i'm excited to see what happens as y'all know man y'all get to vote who y'all think is the strongest some of the best people in the roster and y'all get to you feel me see them in the all-star weekend see if y'all want to get like mvp most improved anime like as a team obviously and feel me all types of stuff we're gonna have mugen all first team second team and third team basically that just means like you feel me the best five people on the first team the best five people on the second team like this is going to be rewards, feel me? So we can see this later on in the future, later tournaments. We can see, yo, who was MVP last season? You know what I mean? Who was on the All-Star team last season? And you feel me? We can see who has the best Mugen tournament career, feel me? But hope you'll enjoy it, man. Lots of stuff is going to be happening. I'm probably going to I'm probably gonna announce this in the next few videos so more people can join the Discord. But feel me? It's down below in the description. Y'all have any problems, just let me know, man. Just DM me. As soon as you join the server, if you guys can't get verified, just DM me. I'll give you verified but without further ado man we're finna get into the first three people we got megami nanami and gojo against gara what's uh gara pain and my boy madara i'm excited to see what happens man i know y'all are too let's get into the first fight in the video all right let's get into the first match of the video i don't know what's going on with the camera there we go okay so we got we got my boy megami we got gara starting off we know megami's very aggressive he's very dangerous depending on what he does but um i'm excited to see how this match goes man we've seen this match in the um Last tournament, Naruto had one, but it was a crazy-ass battle. So we're going to see if 9v9 makes a difference. Can JJK come back even stronger? They got people like Nanami and Megami now who are both pretty strong. Depending on what they pop, Megami, I'm excited to see Megami go off if he can get off a domain expansion. But we see Gara is like, okay, here we go. This is where it's going to start getting dangerous. I was going to say, Gara is putting in work right now. Okay, domain expansion. We got Nanami popping out on the field. And I'm telling you, the domain expansion is so tough. That's where it starts getting dangerous for the other opponents. But Gara has his sand shield on, so you know he takes nerf damage with his sand shield. And feel me, he's pulling out. Yo, Pain is summoning like mad clones. That's just getting real dangerous. Okay. It's like as soon as Megami kills the clones, my boy Pain is bringing in some more. And it's one of the most dangerous assists in the tournament. Literally one of the most craziest ones. And I don't know if Megami's gonna be able to do this. I feel like Nanami's a better like suit for this type of matchup because no character can summon this many clones at once. It's literally just because uh, Gara summoned a clone and Pain summoned a clone. So this is like our first time seeing this like, you know, feel me, this kind of team up. And yo, nah, Megami's still getting through it. So maybe I was wrong. Okay, now we have Shukaku, and he has to deal with the Pain Clones. Megami's gonna have to go through something crazy right now. As y'all know, um, Gara, unlike the tail, the Titans, he doesn't lose health because his is not as good as the Titans, obviously. But he does, um, he has a time limit as well. He will run out of it very soon. But um, I'm not gonna lie. Oh my God! Okay, a second domain. I'm not gonna lie. Was smart because now he gets to waste a little bit of time. He can hit Gara every single second. And yeah, I'm not gonna lie. This is the best way to deal with Gara shit. Okay. My God, Megami's making some good decisions in this battle. As you all know, they still do have Gojo and Nanami in the background, so I'm excited to see what happens with those two. But, um, there we go. Okay, some nice damage. Okay, we got the Tail Beast Bomb coming. Ooh, that's some decent damage. I'm not going to lie. A little Sandballs. Okay. 
okay i'm not gonna lie like i said this is a decent start of the video decent you feel me nothing crazy is going on but it's definitely um okay we got megami damn and megami takes out gara i'm not gonna lie megami put in a lot of work this video already so to gara though scar definitely we're not gonna sleep on gara's accolades feel me now we got gojo and madara they're two strongest i'm not gonna lie two two of the strongest in the verse too man these guys are like ridiculous they will always be known as like some of the craziest people in their shows and um shit gojo will be standing on new gen okay we got infinity i see infinity right now which is gonna be very easy like very good pop obviously very early on but um Right now, I'm not gonna lie, it's not looking too good for my boy Moder. Moder is not starting off great. He's getting a, uh, he's getting destroyed actually by uh my boy Gojo. But here we go, we got Gojo comboing up a little bit. Yo, Moder is getting thrashed around like a dog, bro. Okay, oh Tail Beast. Okay, that's smart. Okay, wait a minute, he just popped a, a collection of good moves. Tail Beast, uh Renegon. It's not gonna be as easy as Gojo thought it was gonna be. I'm about to say Moder, come on, bro. You know the Naruto team is rooting for you. So you know I love Gojo. I love Gojo a little more than I love Madara. Nah, I don't know. It's close. They're both like loves. Like they're so cool, bro. Gojo be going off in his show. Madara is like a demon. Come on. Nobody's ever topping the scene when Madara went against the Shinobi Alliance. Okay. Yo, I'm not gonna lie. It's a close ass fight. And but we know Madara still does have six pass, which is gonna be extremely dangerous for the Naruto team. I mean for JJK. Okay, but will he get it off? I'm not gonna lie. This might be his death here. This might be his death here. Yo, Gojo is not letting Madara fall. Okay, go Madara goes into the background, which is smart because he might get a chance to pop his ten tails. But um, now other people are gonna have to take the wrath of Gojo, like Pain. And it's kind of dangerous for JJK. I'm not gonna lie, even though they do have Nanami at full health, Pain, J Gojo's low and Megami's low. That's like two people you don't want to be low, just because like they don't have that many strong people. Feel me? Like they have strong people, but they don't have that many strong people left in this battle. Feel me? Pain is still full health, damn near. Um, they still do have uh obviously okay this is the best move Megami pop right here okay he comes into the match he drops the domain expansion and this is okay Madara dies from this I'm not gonna lie yo Megami Megami definitely deserves his spot okay Madara didn't die but he's very low okay he's very low he's one tap he comes out feel me they can finish him off okay not me I'm not gonna lie you are the X factor in this match bro your teammates put in the work you have to finish it off we, we need to see an overdrive. I'm not gonna lie. Oh, yeah. Nanami taking the tie off. Jerking the tie. My boy jerking the tie. Y'all know what happens when my boy Nanami starts jerking the tie. Oh, my God. The elephant, the rain, and, like, can't stop. I mean, you cannot stop the rain with Nanami, bro. And he just turns into a, a full-on threat. He loses health pretty fast, and he can take some pretty damaging health. But, um, there goes pain. I'm not gonna lie. I forgot Madara was on 1% health. And JJK takes it with a pretty good margin. I'm not gonna lie, Megami was the MVP of that fight. And it's not debatable. Alright, now we got Rock Lee, Itachi, and Obito against Maki, Jogo, and um I forget who's oh Yuta, Yuta. Can't forget about Yuta. Yuta's a Don. Niggas can't forget about Yuta. Yuta's a demon. We see Rock Lee kind of going off in the last video. He has the combos and stuff. I'm not gonna lie, right now, off rip, he's kind of putting in the combos on Maki. Like he's bro, he be into ultimate attack. Like he just combos down. Rock Lee is a demon. Okay, I'm not gonna lie, bro. Maki is not getting too easy of a break, and she has Itachi to worry about. I'm not gonna lie, somebody needs to help her. Okay, combo. Yep, into the evasive. This Rock Lee is just so nicely, like, he just has nice things in his kit, man. Shout out to my boy Barako. Obviously, he was edited for this tournament heavily, but um, shout out to him. Okay, now we have Maki popping her first ultimate, her first, obviously, her transformation in this tournament. We haven't seen her pop this transformation one singular time, but um, I'm not gonna lie, I didn't even know she had it. I heard that she was getting edited, so I wouldn't. I'm probably not gonna edit her just because I heard that she is getting edited. Yo, she has crazy defense in this mode. I was about to say because she was taking Rock Lee's hits like they were nothing. Okay, like I said, I heard she was getting edited. I would edit her and add her form automatically, but um, my boy Akijan got somebody editing her. I'm pretty sure, so we'll see what happens with that. If not, I'll edit her and give her mode automatically. But okay, we got Jogo coming out here, putting in a little bit of work. JJK started off crazy in the first fight, but um, right now I'm not gonna lie, their second team is putting in work, but um. I don't know if they're ready for this right now. People have been, some people were saying Jogo's tough. Some people were saying Jogo's a fraud. I'm not gonna lie, this is Jogo's time to like, to show he's not a fraud. And I'm not gonna lie, he's starting off the fight. Put it in work on Rock Lee right now. Wait a minute, maybe, uh, maybe he's not a fraud. The Rock Lee's not gonna go out easily, as y'all know. As, like, look at the combos Rock Lee does. I'm not gonna lie, he's very dangerous as a middle person, like obviously the middle team. He's like somebody you're, you don't wanna have to go against real early because he just dynamic entries, leaf whirlwind, 
this little punch move, whatever this is called. And I'm not gonna lie, Rock Lee might go 2-0. I remember, I'm not gonna lie, will Rock Lee be able to solo the whole team of JJK? This boy's a demon. I'm not gonna lie, Jogo's demons is kind of messing with Rock Lee right now. And Rika's gonna come out, so I don't know if Rock Lee's gonna be able to do it all. But, um, okay, yeah, yeah. It's, it's, I don't think Rock Lee can do it all just because of Rika. And obviously, Jogo's little flies and shit is gonna be very annoying. Okay, Rika's here. Rock Lee is trying, though. I'm not gonna lie. Rock Lee is, we can't say Rock Lee's not trying. Um, okay. He tries to pop ultimate attack. I don't know why he's not popping his mode, but um, maybe he doesn't. Uh, I'm not gonna lie. I don't think he, he's able to get. I think he took too much damage to get his mode off now. Yeah, he's very low. I'm not gonna lie. Rock Lee didn't get his mode off, but I think Rock Lee did more than enough this video for the JJK team. Y'all can still hear the flies, bro. Why the hell can I still hear them? Okay. Okay. Rock Lee goes into the background to be an assist. Now we have Obito, and I'm pretty sure yeah, this match is over. Rock Lee. I'm not gonna lie. Rock Lee sparked, bro. My boy Rock Lee just went crazy. I like, like he deserves to be on the thumbnail of this video, no cap, but we already had him on one. And this is just we still might get him on one though. I'm not gonna lie, I don't know. I didn't make the thumbnail yet. Y'all probably gonna see it. But um Yuta getting some combos on the wall. King Yuta bring it back. I don't think so, obviously, just because you feel me, he's a he's a lone man team. Jogo got a little bit of health, but uh Rock Lee just went off, man. I'm not gonna lie. So we're going to be getting into a final battle, it looks like. Maybe. Yeah, Jogo's the last one left. And I don't think Jogo's going to be able to take on all of, uh, all of uh, Naruto. I'm not going to lie. Obito don't got that much health. But you know Obito does. Okay, domain expansion. Yo, I know people are editing Jogo. Yo, Aikiji, make sure he starts popping that domain, bro. That shit looks so cool. But y'all already know. And shit. Honestly, let's get into uh, the final matchup. All right, I've been reading and I've been listening to y'all. A lot of people are calling Sasuke a fraud, so he shouldn't be on the like the strongest person on the strongest team. I'm gonna retest him out. I'll put him against Obito. If after this video, obviously I'm not changing the first video, but if uh, Sasuke is weak in the Obito, he will go on the second team. Obito will be on the number one team. But um, off rip, yo Naruto's getting played with. Sukuna comes out early, which is good but bad because if JJK loses Sukuna, then feel me, that's dangerous. Y'all don't want to lose Sukuna this early. And Naruto is isn't the strongest guy, but he can give Sukuna some pain. I'm not gonna lie, he he's not the strongest, but he definitely could give Sukuna some pain. Okay, all right, we got Naruto going in six tails early just because he's getting shredded down. Naruto's a demon, but like I said, he's not a speed demon. So if he's versus somebody extremely fast, it's gonna be a hard fight for him. Okay, six tails looking lit. I'm not gonna lie, we're gonna see how that goes. We know six tail is extremely strong depending on what Naruto does, but yeah, counter. He's just getting countered down. Sukuna's not coming to play. He's not coming to play at all. Like I said, we all know whoever loses this as well end up in the loser's bracket. So y'all don't have to worry too heavily. But um, I think Naruto's finna get taken out of the competition early. Okay. Two tail beast bombs that did extreme damage. Like I said, Sukuna does not want to lose too much health to Naruto. But Naruto is strong. That's one thing. Oh, this might hurt. And Minato's on the field. Does it hit both of them? Oh, it misses because they're both on the ground. Okay, that I'm not gonna lie, that was clutch. That was luck. I'm not gonna lie, that was real luck. But okay. We know Naruto is not weak at all, like I said, but Sukuna is just a counter demon. Sukuna has lost some health to Naruto, which is going to be extremely dangerous. I don't know if you want to do that, feel me? You know what I mean? Like, that's somebody you don't want to lose health to. Okay, Naruto comes into his, uh, he came out in, uh, his other mode, but I think Naruto, yeah, Naruto's dead. Okay. Now we have Sasuke and, um, Yo, he's popping assist in here. And yo, Akisa, don't hear nothing, bro, because niggas is stuck in here and they get hit by assist. So don't say that about Netero no more. But I'm not gonna lie, it's not looking good. Okay, Sasuke. Wait, Sasuke turned it around for Naruto. I'm not gonna lie, if Sukuna falls here, I don't see nobody taking down. I'm not gonna lie, Minato is really strong. I think Sukuna's gonna have to take down Minato. Okay. Okay. This nigga has Sukuna in the corner like a dog. I'm not gonna lie. Sukuna goes away, though. Sukuna survived. He went away. Now it's Mahito's turn. My Yo, this is a close-ass final battle. Okay. Oh, we know he can one-shot people with that move if he grabs them enough times. I'm not gonna lie. It's like a, it's like a random condition. Like, he, can, like, I've seen him grab people five times and it doesn't kill. So, it, it can happen sometimes. It can happen other times. And Sukuna dies in the background getting hit. Okay, so now it's just up to Mahito and Miwa. We can see what they can do. You see Naruto and Sasuke are both already very low. Simple domain. That's an extremely strong move. He didn't combo extend off of it, which he should have. Black Flash. Okay. Yo, this shit is extremely close. Simple domain again. 
The simple domain twice in a row. Oh my god, that hurts. And Sasuke's out for the count. It's a domain expansion. Oh my god, we haven't seen this. No way. Oh nah, and we know how overpowered the domain expansion. I think it's over. I think it's over. And it's just an overpowered move. It's damn near. It's a one shot. It's literally a one shot. You cannot do anything about it. But he. This is the first time he's popped it in damn near two tournaments. What a clutch move to take them down. But I don't think Minato can die unless he goes into his Tentails mode. Oh no, wait, Minato's dead. It's up to Sasuke. Can Sasuke clutch out? No, he can't. I was about to say, man. Oh man, JJK moves on. Naruto put it in that fucking work, man. I'm proud of Naruto. They definitely went crazy. They will be back in the loser's bracket, so don't worry for the people who are wondering, man. They, they, they definitely feel me that we can see something crazy. But I hope you all enjoyed it, man. More videos coming very, very soon. Like I said, Naruto falls here, but JJK will move on. Obviously, to go versus um, JoJo versus JJK. Going to be a great matchup. Y'all let me know down below if y'all excited. Tomorrow, we are coming here with One Piece versus Attack on Titan, man. I'm excited to see how that goes. A lot of people are saying One Piece is slamming. Shit, we going to see. I hope you enjoy it. We out of here.